All right, this is a valve lash adjustment on a B18 or no B16 LS VTEC. Okay, I'm gonna give you give you a little bit of advice. I'm um, go and turn all your nuts. You're gonna need what you're gonna make your job easier is one of these right here when you go tighten it up. Um, you can use a little socket if you want to to loosen them up, but you're gonna need this because you're gonna have to hold that little screw. You don't turn the screw to 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 tighten it. All you're doing is adjusting your lash with the screw, and you're gonna hold that still, and then turn the nut to tighten the screw down. So do not turn the screw to tighten anything down. It's your a lash adjustment screw. That's all it's gonna do. Your nut's gonna tighten everything down. So remember that. Don't strip the nut neither or the, the screw. Okay, what I do is, is I'm gonna give you a little bit of advice. I go through, here's your specs. Right here, I already wrote them down. Exhaust, this is what you need to be within this. Okay, intake. There's a difference between the two because of temperature wise. And what I'm going to do is I'm setting all of mine at 0 .007. That gives me, so I don't go un over and I don't go under. So I'm staying right in that. And how to check when you set yours at 0 .007 is... If you can't get a .008 in there, you're good. And you'll be able to get a .006. But it's that number there. These two numbers is more important. Go to your .007, .004. Now, how I do that is I, I loosen that up and I'll take a regular screwdriver. And this is going to be hard for me because I'm trying to hold everything still. And you see this here. Remember, this is just to adjust. You'll see right here, it just adjusts the screw. Nut and the screw will be turning. Okay, and then what I do is I slide this in and out. Yeah. In there. I'll make sure I get that seven in there, you see. That seven. And you'll, it'll grab when you get it tight enough. You, you'll you feel it grabbing it. And you don't want it tight to where you can't pull it out, out, but you don't want it. It should be making a noise. It should be tight. Okay, and then double check that. All you have to do is point, pull your .008 out. If it doesn't fit, you're in good shape. That means you're at .007, and that's where you want to be. Um, that's what you want to aim for. And when you go to tighten all this up, this little tool here will help you. You'll, you'll make sure that you can see that little window. There's a little window right there. And you'll slide that down and you see where that screw is. You'll make sure, and it's hard to do that, but you'll make sure that screw goes in there. It's right on the top of there. And then you'll hold the screwdriver while turning this handle to tighten It'll go lefty loosey, righty tighty. So remember that. And then you'll double check this stuff. And another thing is, make sure that your lobes are up top on each exhaust cylinder. Make sure they are pointing up. You move to the next one. That one's not up. You turn it till it's up. And that'll make sure that your valves are all the way closed. So, any questions, leave a comment, all that good stuff. Like, subscribe, don't cost you anything. If this video helps you out, thank you for your support. Thanks for watching.